Popeye the Sailor Man. I'm Popeye the Sailor Man. I'm strong to the finish, cause I eat the spinach. Yeah? Wham! I'm Popeye the Sailor Man. Hello there, cartoon lovers. Welcome to the Popeye Show on Cartoon Network. Our first cartoon this evening comes from early 1936, just under three years into Popeye's 24-year animated motion picture career. Directed by Dave Fleischer, as all of the Fleischer Popeyes were, here's a clean-shaven man. The fellow escorting olive oil there at the end was none other than Giesel from E.C. Seeger's Thimble Theater comic strip. Let's move on up to 1937, and yet another of the Fleischer Studios shorts that would later be remade by famous studios. Here's Protect the Weakerist. Protect the Weakerist was remade in color 12 years later, as barking dogs don't fight. When we return, Popeye has a delivery for his friends across the pond. In the early 1940s, many film studios showed their support of the war effort by making propaganda films or morale boosters. While many cartoons were made specifically for the troops fighting overseas, others were made to entertain the general public at home, like this wartime effort from famous studios. In 1943, here's Spinach for Britain. Spinach for Britain was the sixth Popeye cartoon from Famous Studios and the third Popeye cartoon from director Izzy Sparber. That's it for this episode of The Popeye Show. Thanks for watching.